So there's this holographic understanding of reality that everything exists within everything. Now, some of you may be thinking about the Lauren Hill song, Everything is Everything. Um, of course, this is a truth that's echoed across many different traditions, including, in that case, the tradition of hip hop. But because everything is present in that teacup, if you do this practice with that understanding, by truly weaving in that teacup, the perception of that teacup, and even the limited perceiver who is perceiving it, you're actually doing it for the whole of creation. And the maxim, the nyaya that illustrates this is really nice. If you have a great sovereign, that means they are the ruler of a vast kingdom, a great territory, a great sphere of influence, a mandala. And even if they're just walking through that sphere and visiting a village within that kingdom, they are still the ruler of the entire kingdom, no matter what part of it they are present in. And so this is a way of understanding the fullness of reality exists in every fragment of reality. And therefore, you don't have to, if you really do this pra practice and with this deeper understanding, you don't have to do it for everything. This automatically will reverberate and echo through every string and facet of your world of experience. Okay. We're almost there at the conclusion.